guys welcome back to my channel so I'm Logan and if you're not new here you may notice something a little new I cut my hair so today is Saturday and I actually cut my hair last Sunday so tomorrow will be a week I cut a lot off actually because if you remember it was pretty long like it was down to my butt so yeah uh, I cut up like over 12 inches off and I actually donated it. just above my shoulders and um so I have it parted to the side right now but sometimes I part it down the middle I just kind of I don't know depends on how I feel I guess and like which way it kind of wants to go for the day so but like yeah right now it's just parted to the side I'll show you the back and so I haven't done anything with it today so this is just all I did was brush it, so this is just kind of how it looks naturally. Um, and so, if you can't tell, I literally only cut it. I didn't dye it or anything. Um, but later today, Jordan and I are actually going to be going somewhere for dinner, and I would like to kind of practice with it, I guess. And I'm going to attempt to curl it. So I'm going to bring you guys along with me for that. I'm gonna do a get ready with me, I guess. So, yeah. And so, if you see me squinting a little bit, it's because the sun is like right there and it's kind of bright in my eyes. So, uh, yeah, just kind of ignore me like making faces or whatever. It's because of the sun. Um, so, I've had a lot of people that were like in shock that I cut my hair. Even though I kept telling them like, you know, at work and stuff that I was gonna cut my hair, but I guess they didn't believe me. So they were like, I mean, it was, I got all kind of reactions. Like some of them were like, I know you didn't. And I was like, what? And they were like, I know you didn't cut your hair. And I was like, yeah. And just, um, you know, a lot of, everybody said it looked good, you know, and um, they asked me if I donated it and um, how much should I get cut off and stuff like that. Um, and all, they all were always asking me how I like it and stuff. To be honest, I don't really know yet. It's still getting some used to because this is a big change for me. And that's what I wanted. I mean, honestly, um, you know, everybody keeps asking me why did you cut it and stuff like that. I literally just wanted a change because I've had my hair really long for a long time. And I just wanted to change it up and maybe see if shorter hair kind of um, made me look a little older, you know, or whatever. And I just got tired of having to deal with it being so long. So, there's that. But it's definitely, it definitely feels different, like, when I'm brushing it. Because when I'm brushing it, it's just, I just stop, like, right there, you know. And normally, I, like, brush the top and then I pull around and I would have to brush the bottom half like that. And then also, whenever I'm um, washing it, it feels a lot different, too. Because, one, I don't have to use as much product. Um, but also that was always a two part process for me as well because I would wash the front, I mean, I'm sorry, the top first and then I would do, pull it around and I would wash the bottom half. So now just, it's basically top, the top like that I have to wash. It's a lot easier. Also, it doesn't take as long to dry. My hair would take forever to dry. I'm talking air dry 
or with a hair dryer. So I've always let my hair air dry as much as possible first, and then if I need to blow dry it, then I would do that. Um, and now it doesn't take nearly as long. So yeah. But I mean, I guess I'm excited for it. Kind of excited to like try some different styles with it and stuff like that and just see what I can do with it. My plan is to leave it short for a while, like through the summer, and then I might start growing it back out again. So I think that's my plan. I think that's what I'm going to do. So anyways, um, you guys want to see Riley? Riley, come here. So I guess I'm going to finish playing with her right now. And then when it's time for me to get ready for our date, I will check back in with you guys and you guys can watch me get ready. Okay, so I'm in here about to get ready um, for our like date or whatever it is. Um, we're talking about going to see in a movie too. So I guess it's a date. Anyways, so I got my wand getting hot that's when i'm gonna use to curl my hair and i'm about to put some makeup on i'm not really sure if i'm gonna um change my outfit or keep it on because like i don't know <clears throat> i'm kind of already warm in these clothes so i don't know if i want to change or not or maybe if i just want to put on jeans or something i don't know because like right now i'm just wearing this like um sweatshirt thing and some leggings so yeah we'll see Okay, so let's start with some makeup. I also have a candle going too. It's the sweater weather. I wonder if I should, ooh, I should probably move my hair out of the way. Um, I guess I could like, I could do it like this. Just put it up in a little, ponytail thing so that I won't be falling down in my face while I'm putting my makeup on. I think that the lady cut this hair too short because it never fits in the ponytail. My makeup is actually a little too dark for me right now, but I haven't, I don't know, I haven't bought any new makeup because I'm not really having much money, but I never think about it. Like when I go to the store, I never think about getting new makeup. I hardly ever wear makeup, so I definitely don't think about it. So I know you're already probably wondering, yes, this is a toothbrush, but no, this is not a toothbrush that I use to brush my teeth with. I literally only use it for doing my eyebrows. Um, I don't really know why, but I use that instead of a brow brush or whatever. So yeah, let's see. I mean, also I'm just doing light makeup because I don't want to put a whole bunch of makeup on and then be like having to take it off later tonight so we're just doing simple makeup i guess i can tell you the products that i'm using just in case you're curious so the foundation is the CoverGirl 
it's a hydrating one. Um, and then it's the buff beige and then the, I'm using the CoverGirl Clean Matte. Um, and I'm not one that really sticks to a particular, like, set of makeup. I just kind of change it up. To be honest, I kind of get what's, like, on sale, I guess. I don't go buying expensive makeup. I don't. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. I'm a cheap gal. Let's see. I'm going to do a little eyeshadow. curious so the two I like just used was um, this one and so it was two lights but I used this color first and then I used this the barely there with this color because I didn't I don't know I just don't really want much I just kind of want to go I guess for like the natural look or whatever even though obviously it's not natural. Um, okay, and then this is the mascara that I'm gonna be using. Okay. I think I'm gonna go in with <clears throat> a little bit of this one. colors or whatever. And that's my eyeshadow. I mean, uh, mascara. And then, just going to add a little blush. So I'm just going to be using this and probably going to be using this one. There we have it. Ooh, I think I need to fix that eyebrow a little bit. Okay, here's the final look for the makeup. Alright, um, now moving on to the hair. Okay, let's take this down. So do I want to part it in the middle or to the side? What is it doing? I think I'm going to do it right there. it for 20 seconds. Oh, I can't even figure out where the next piece is. This knocker. This is difficult. I might, oh, I might should have done like half up, half down or something. And this, was, this is not good. This is not working. Oh, this is not going to work. Okay. New plan. Um, Let's do the bottom half first, I guess. Okay. 
It's so short. I can't hardly even do it. I don't want to burn my ear or my fingers. this is working out. Ow. What do you want me to do? Go to the gym. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing, guys. I don't know what I'm doing. If you have short hair and you know how to curl it, can you leave some comments down below, you know, some tips or something? Because I can't do this. Ow! It's too hot. So this is the hair. Something's not right about this one. Whatever, we're just going with this. All right, so 360 view. Something's going on over here, but oh well. So they'll probably like loosen up, anyways. Okay, so I am going to figure out if I'm gonna change clothes or if I'm gonna stay in this, and then I will see you guys in a little while, okay?
Okay, so here's the final fit. So I kept the same uh, sweatshirt on and I actually put a long sleeve shirt underneath it because I had just this like undershirt, but it's getting pretty cold out there. So I put this gray um, long sleeve underneath and then I have this to keep me warm. And I did decide to put on some jeans and the shoes that I'm wearing are my Uggs. And this is just my jacket. And then, um, so I did put my, I put some little earrings in and then I'm probably gonna put my rings on that I normally wear, but they're actually in the car, so I'll just put them on in there. So we're about to hit the road, we're gonna go to Pooler, and we're gonna watch a movie, probably Pets 2, and we're gonna get some supper, so yeah. I may like insert some clips or something, but I'm not gonna really try to um, record while we're at the places, so. Okay, so we just got back a few minutes ago from uh, pooler and I took my makeup off and I'm probably gonna like take a shower like get ready for bed and stuff like that but um so I didn't take any videos of either place that we went to um so the place that we ate at it really was not the best um I was expecting more but it really I don't know it's kind of a disappointment um but when the movie we went to go see was Sing 2 can't remember if I told you that or not, but, uh, it was really good, like, I think it was better than the first one, but that's just me, but, um, it was really good, so I'd say that our date night went pretty good, so, yeah, I'll just catch you guys in the next video.